A massive change is in the works for students at St. Francis College in downtown Brooklyn. For the first time in 60 years, the new semester starts at a brand new campus with brand new classrooms with all sorts of up to the up up to the date up to date stuff. CBS 2's Hannah Klieger got an exclusive first look at what students and faculty can expect. Um. It's a work in progress everywhere you look inside this building at 179 Livingston Street. Glass is being installed, walls are being painted. In short, they're in a race against the clock. How confident are you that it's going to be ready? We're basically three weeks probably out from the start of classes. I do, I have to say, I started sweating a little bit. On September 6th, right before classes begin, St. Francis College is debuting their brand new campus, a project their president says has been four years in the making. It was a pretty bold decision for the college. They're selling their old campus on Remsen Street to help finance the project. The space, I believed, was inadequate for 21st century learning. Been in that space now 60 plus years. The campus will boast a 300 seat auditorium, a chapel and multi-faith room, a rooftop terrace, multiple science labs, and a much expanded state-of-the-art nursing department. You know, we designed it as if it was an actual hospital. Occupying the fifth, sixth, and seventh floors of the Wheeler Building, the space sprawls for a total of 255,000 square feet. They designed this campus with hybrid learning in mind. Some people are saying, oh, yeah, now we can do hybrid because of COVID. We were going in that direction prior to COVID. And starting this upcoming semester, the college will be offering several new degrees in a variety of fields like community health, entrepreneurship and global studies. Franciscan brothers came in 1859 to create conditions for folks that were then not given opportunities. To do that effectively, you have to have state-of-the-art learning environments. He says their goal of openness and accessibility can be seen not just in the glass walls and open floor plan, but in their student body as well. About 85% of our students come from New York City public schools. With time ticking, you don't need much imagination to see the long-awaited project come to life. In downtown Brooklyn, Hannah Klieger, CBS 2 News.